I decided to go out on my own and I started my my first real company building a platform for uh, real human health goals trying to uh, combine all of the things that we had done at Slide in terms of gamification and uh, collaborative goaling and match that with coaches, trainers and nutritionists. I sold that company to Jawbone where we were building uh, some of the first wearable trackers and building some of those first algorithms in machine machine learned algorithms for understanding human physiology and behavior, detecting things like apneas and arrhythmias and sleep data. On this episode, I have with me Jeremiah Robison. He is the founder and CEO of Psionic, an innovative company that builds lightweight and durable bionic clothing driven by powerful algorithms that adapt in real time to each individual's mobility needs. Shortly after that, I got um, my daughter's diagnosis that she had cerebral palsy. And for a few years, I was living in that duality of being a parent with very little solutions uh, available for people with neural differences, and then being an entrepreneur and trying to build the future. And uh, in 2018, I decided if not me, who? And if not now, when? And I stepped down and started Psionic. Regardless of what the skill set is that you're bringing to the table as an entrepreneur, um, you have to own the business. And you can own the business in, a diff in different ways, but like me talking to you and telling you about this origin story and why it means so much to me, that's that's a thing that's hard to farm out, right? Like you, it's impossible to farm out. And that's why so many of these founder-led companies, when they lose their initial founder, they they kind of lose their way, right? They have no rudder as to what it is that brings it all together. And then, you know, it's how do you translate that? Or how do you um, impart that obsession and that passion and find the right people who share that with you? And so, you know, I think if you can, and if you do find those people, then it just sort of all happens organically. People sort of step up and say like, let me take that off your plate, or let's find the gap and find someone who can fill that in. And then you're bringing, you're bringing a whole set of skills to the table. And it doesn't quite matter where they're coming from as long as you have that complete picture. Um, and you know enough to know where your fault lines are um, so that you can bridge them.